Welcome into the Truth Serum, everybody. Joey the Truth Wagner with you. Hollywood to my right. Victor on the Skype line. Uh, Steelers lose 26-17 to the Raiders. And, Victor, we've been talking about this for months. Since May, we've been talking about how brutal this schedule is. And I knew this game wouldn't be easy. But with being a home game against the Raiders, this was one you needed to have. This was one you needed to have. And they didn't get it done. They didn't get it done. You stole one last week in Buffalo. You stole one last week against the Bills. That doesn't give you the right to drop this one. It doesn't. It doesn't. And I mean... I mean... Head coach Mike Tomlin. My gosh. For a coach? For a coach who says we don't live in our fears? Sure lives in his fears a lot. A lot. I mean, not the first time we brought this up. He's done this before with the wild card game against Cleveland last year. Fourth and one near midfield. Fourth and one down 12. Moving the ball. Moving, moving, moving. You only need, need a yard. He punts. Cleveland goes down, scores. Ball game. Today, nine minutes to go. Fourth and one at your own 35. Your offense got a touchdown on the previous drive. Your defense struggled in the second half. What do you do? What should have... He punted. He lived in his own fears. Vegas went down, got a field goal of their own, made it a two-score game, and took time off the clock. I'll say this, Victor. For a man who has these cliches of the standard being the standard and us not living in our own fears... He sure doesn't follow the advice that flows out of his own mouth. I'll say that. No, the, the, here's the big one for me with Tomlin. Uh, you know I'm always the number one guy to defend him. Uh, with Tomlin, it's just it's getting to a point where it's like he's a great coach and he steps up big moments. But it, he gets to a point now where it's like I think someone needs to be making his final just minute decisions. Cause me! 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 Uh, but, I mean, I'm being honest. I, I, I'm being honest. Me! But it's, it's, it's just getting to a point now, bro, where you can't afford another two or three of these mistakes to happen to the season because I don't... Your, your, your schedule's just too brutal, bro. It's brutal. I know. I, I, I know, Victor. We, we've been saying this. I need to get on. Here's another rant you need to get on. What in the I'm sorry, what in the hell was Trey Turner doing spitting in someone's face? And then after still going back and when Zach I don't know and when Ben tries to push you up, you're still over there fighting like a little you're acting like a ten year old, bro. I don't know. I didn't see the spit. I didn't see the actual clip of it happening, Victor. But just from me reading it, that is low. Low. But that's what I'm saying, forget the spit. You're already in the wrong. Why are you still trying to fight? You look like a coward, bro. Why are you still trying to fight? It's bad. Bad you know, luck. Bad. You can get suspended. He's most likely going to get suspended next week for that. I hope he doesn't, but if he does, I guess I'll have content to talk about. I really don't know what else to say. To do that, that that is bad. 26-17 uh, the final, and then Deontay Johnson getting injured on the final play. Mm -hmm. When the game was, you know... Okay. Over. That I don't like. Uh, was grabbing his knee. So hopefully it's nothing major with him because he's the guy on this Steelers offense. He's the guy who gets separation. Yep. He's the guy who gets separation. He just does. He's that guy. That's what he does. Yeah. There's something I need to say also to Kevin Colbert, the general manager. 
He's sitting on about seven to maybe six to seven million dollars in cap space. Get a tackle. He needs, huh? Get a tackle. You need to get a tackle. It's ridiculous. Dan Moore's been impressive, but you need a tackle. Dan Moore needs to be your third tackle. Zach Banner needs to get out there when he's available. You need to sign a tackle. Chooks isn't good right now. No, no, and it's it, it's not just that. This offense is talented. Ben is still Ben in my eye. He's not Ben 2012, but he's Ben who can do something for you. This guy is pushing the ball down to, but he he he's trying to run around. He doesn't have the time. You you're sitting on money. You cannot let that group carry you throughout the season. You're not going to go nowhere. You can't. This team is too it, talented, and the core is getting too old to waste it. Yep. yep. That defense is not going to be good another year or two from now. Well, I mean it will be, but it's going to start slowing down. Yeah, a lot of question marks here, Victor. A lot of question marks as the Raiders win 26-17.